Good morning. Uh, so today is Monday. I'm already confused by what day of the week it is. I thought I would show you guys what I'm wearing um, this week. So today I have this um, polo on. It's from Zara. It's just in a really nice kind of neutral beigey color. And then I got this uh, blazer. I actually showed it to you guys a while ago. Um, from Penny's or Primark. It's like a longish blazer. It kind of comes down to like mid thigh um, in black and it's so handy. I literally have worn it I'd say twice a week since getting it. I really wanted like a nice long line blazer and it's just it's the right fit. So just paired it with this polo today. Then I have black Topshop belt that I live in and then these Lee jeans from Topshop. They're just a nice plain black, very boring and I've got my Gucci's on. And then in terms of jewellery I have simple hoops on. These are from and other stories. I think I get basically all my jewellery and on other stories. This ring's from there. These rings are from there. I have to get all my shellac gel off. No, shellac off. Um, on Saturday, taking a break from shellac because I feel a bit naked with such short nails. Um, but hopefully they'll be grown in time for my birthday and I can get like a nice nice little mag here. Um, and then makeup. So this is just my normal normal everyday makeup. I'm pretty sure I did a video on it so I'll link it up here. But yeah, that's what I'm wearing today. And my my black coat because it's still pretty cold um, but yeah I'm gonna leave now because yeah I should have left five minutes ago so a um, little change in the whole um, what I wore in a week situation so I uh, had to go to the doctor on one day after I showed you my outfit and was in the doctor's surgery for four hours which was amazing and uh, basically told that I'm quite sick I have three different things going on sinus infection throat infection the whole the whole works so yesterday there was nothing to show you because I was literally in sweatpants for the entire day and sleeping um so I'm go I go through like spurts of feeling okay and feeling like I have energy and feeling normal again which is why I'm filming right now because I'm in that stage and then like in 10 minutes I'm going to be asleep probably and coughing and feeling like shit so that's fun um, but I'll show you what I'm wearing anyway because <laughs> why not so I am wearing, I'm living in my Uggs, comfiest things I own, so living in those. These leggings from uh, Nike are insanely comfortable. It's really hard to see, but they have these like mesh panels here um, and they're really comfy. I bought them when we were in um, LA in Santa Monica and I spent way too much money on them, but they're really comfy so you know no regrets and then the this jumper really loose and comfy is from H&M and it's just a simple v-neck sweater that's just really comfortable my hair is wild because I've just had a shower I've been signed off work for a week um, and I'm already going up the walls with boredness uh, with boredness is boredness a word boredom talking is really hard lately um yeah so up the walls with boredom um but hoping that I will get to feel normal by the weekend Um, obviously I'll be taking it easy but yeah that's, that's all that's going on with me very boring but I'm just really glad it happened this week and not next week because next week and uh yeah next weekend I'm going away um, so that would have sucked but yeah so that's it for today very casual comfy 
books are the best thing ever. Old slippers, they're so comfy. Um, but if you need me, I will be here uh, lying on my bed, taking medication and sleeping. Great. Hello, hello. It is Thursday. Oh, I have a look. And I managed to get dressed today, which is really good going for me currently. So I'm wearing this white linen shirt from Zara that I got on sale like over a year ago. It's got these splits at the side. And then also from Zara. I'm probably super blown out because it's very sunny. I'm wearing these, I call them my painter pants. Just wearing them because they're loose and comfy. And then I've got my Gucci's on and these are my Ray-Bans. They're the, um, they're the round lens and this is the large size. I got these like two years ago and they're honestly like my go-to sunglasses. Um, I have these in pink as well and also the more classic Ray-Bans but these are like my babies. Got dressed today, that was, that was an accomplishment but I'm so tired, so it's like half three. I'm gonna go and nap. I've been napping every day for like four or five hours in the middle of the day. This uh, illness has knocked it out of me. Okay, just before I nap, I wanna show you a couple of things that I've just got today. My mom was super cute and got this for me. If it'll focus, it's um, a body mist. So it's a coconut body mist from Another Stories and it smells unbelievable. It's like so fresh. It smells like summer holidays. It's so good. I want to see if it'll... And what I like about this is the girl in the store was saying that um, you can recycle these so you bring them into store and they'll um, recycle the packaging which is really good. Um, and they also had these little um, samples. So this is a new scent coming in April. Fresh cotton and liquid musks night swimming in the glittering orchid waters of Positano. Okay, V intense, but I'm definitely going to try this out. And then, um, this is from Nail Tech and it's for soft nails. It's a strengthener. As you can see, I have no shellac on. Um, me and my um, nail technician decided to give my nails a break from shellac for a while and so I'm going to use this for the next month to strengthen my nails. I have been using some other stuff um, but this was recommended so I um, got this today. So basically you put a layer on every day and then after a week you take it all off and then you start again. So. I'm going to nap but I'll put this on this evening and I get started and I'll let you know how I get on. But yeah, I'm so tired now. I'm going for a nap. That's enough. Hello, it is Friday today um, and I got dressed again today so that's successful. Um, I just had to go and get um, some alterations that I've had done. So I'll show them to you now. Sorry, there's like ironing boards and everything here. But I'll show you what I'm wearing today. So, same leggings as before. The Nike ones and these Nike trainers, the all black ones. These are ancient. I've literally had to eat these for two years. But they're so, so comfy. And then this top I got when I was in... LA last September. It's from Brandy Melville. It's just a nice little cropped top. Um, I've actually been, I have the matching shorts for this and I've been wearing it as pajamas. Um, but I just thought it was handy to wear today because I'm actually really warm today. I have a bit of a fever. Um, so that's what I'm wearing now and I have my leather jacket over there. But let me show you the alterations. Okay, so the first thing is these trousers from Zara. Not great with this crop top, but they're a really, 
really high rise um, wide leg pant. I had to have them altered because there was so much excess fabric. So I had them altered to just fit the height of these um, shoes that I have. They look a bit strange in the mirror, but obviously I don't have the right things on with it. But yeah, these were, I think, 40 or 50 in um, Zara. So I need to kind of let them loosen out because they're, the pleat in them is quite intense at the bottom. These are the trousers. I really, really like them. I have a matching blazer that I'm going to wear with them. Um, but I don't have that here with me. But yeah, really like them. Super, super high-waisted. But they're pretty cool. Okay. This is the dress. It's not the most flattering, and believe it or not, I've had it taken out a lot. So this is one I actually showed you guys um, in a previous video that I bought from Zara, and they didn't have my size, which was a little bit smaller. So I decided to just get it taken in. So I actually got a good bit taken in either side. I got quite a bit taken off the end. It was kind of more ankle length, um, but I'm planning on wearing this with a belt. Actually, do I have the belt with me? No, I didn't bring the belt with me, I thought I had, but basically I'm planning on putting the belt kind of where this seam is here and just cinching it in a little bit more. But I think it's it's really nice and floaty, definitely nice for um, like a sun holiday to have something light and kind of breezy. Um, and I really like polka dots, so I figured why not get it altered. It's definitely not the most flattering thing I own, but I still really like it, so... Okay, my room, it gets super, super dark um, in the evenings, so I've had to move downstairs just to show you my outfit. The bottom is just like the Lee jeans that I was wearing on Monday, and my loafers, same as always. Um, but I'm wearing this top, it's actually my sister's, um, because I wasn't originally planning, like I was supposed to be in my place, so I would have had my own stuff but obviously I'm in my parents place so I brought this off my sister it's this cute little stretchy kind of Spanishy dramatic um sleeve thing also ignore all the noise my entire family is upstairs trying to get ready for this party so you can see my makeup better here so I just did kind of my usual very crappy liner and all that kind of stuff but it's my first time putting on makeup since Monday so I'm gonna cut myself a break um and I've added jewelry again first time wearing jewellery since Monday, uh, so it's pretty good going for me. Um, that's all my efforts for this week. It's obviously not a normal week because I was sick in my parents' place instead of my own place, so I didn't have access to a lot of my clothes. But I will do this again, hopefully on a week when I'm not ill, <laughs> and you'll actually see what I wear in a regular week. Um, but yeah, that's all for this video. I will see you guys next week. Mwah.